Hello everyone. My topic is about management challenges at historic houses and the balancing of emission and budgets at these institutions. I became interested in this subject after reading about some of the unique activities house managers have come up with in order to meet budget demands. Historic house museums are struggling to survive in the 21st century. The challenge of sustaining a historic house and all the repairs that come along with maintaining one of these structures is becoming more critical. While these cultural institutions are striving to remain relevant to visitors, the traditional sources of financial revenue that comes in each year through admission fees is simply not enough to support staff and take care of these aging facilities. The response to this pressure is leading management at historic houses to venture off more into new territory in order to obtain resources which will allow the managers and the board of directors to care for the houses and the future preservation of them. So how do managers at historic house museums balance the challenge of mission and profit? Facilities, rentals, and special events are a good way to bring in additional income. But what about the wear and tear on the house? Mistakes happen, and visitors often accidentally spill beverages and leave behind food crumbs which create additional problems with rodents. What effect will repeated damage at a historic house museum have on its longevity? Also, managers must consider the extra burden placed on staff having to prepare and host additional events. The issue of declining attendance at historic house museums isn't exactly a new one. The majority of house museums have been reporting a decline in attendance since 1976, when America turned 200 and interest in history soared. However, now that economic cir circumstances have somewhat flipped the script in some respects, what risk are managers willing to take in order to keep the doors to these museums open? More importantly, in the end, does all the effort really pay off? I want to explore the dual challenges of mission and profit at historic house museums, and my research will focus on four historic houses from around the country that are hosting special events as a way to make more money for their organizations. Thank you.